Hi, my name is Andy Viner and welcome to Media Talk. Media Talk is our flagship publication and in this edition we're looking back at 2018, which is a record year in terms of media M&A. So in terms of global deals, the deal values in 2018 were over 120 billion and that was dominated by a few large global deals such as Comcast's 30 billion deal for Sky. But what we're seeing is that the US continues to be dominant in terms of media M&A deals with around 40% of deals led by the US. What's an increasing trend is the number of deals being done in the emerging markets. We're seeing South Korea, Japan and India particularly showing good signs of strong growth in media and M&A deals. So on the domestic side, the UK's held its own, a very small 1% decline in terms of media M&A, basically due to the backdrop around Brexit, political and economic uncertainty. But what we've seen is the weakening pound attracting overseas buyers, particularly from the US, taking advantage of the uh, exchange rate conditions. So we've seen a huge amount of private equity money continue to be invested in the sector. The hot sectors are publishing, broadcasting, media rights, particularly sports rights and music rights, and also marketing services continues to be an active part of the sector. We just launched a media talk survey, our first media talk survey at the end of 2018. What we're seeing is a huge amount of confidence in the sector. Around 77% of executives believe that 2019 will be better or much better compared to 2018, with only 3% saying that they expect a decline in 20, 2019 versus 2018. Looking ahead, over 50% of the executives that we surveyed expect that media M&A will be a key source of growth strategy for next year, and I expect the 2019 to continue to show excellent growth in the media sector. Um, and I'm really excited and looking forward to the year ahead.